Hey guys, this is a H-Bridge circuit using a L293 H-Bridge chip and this is a pretty somewhat complicated circuit so I put a link to where you can find the schematic below this video and how this circuit works is there's three switches there's a toggle switch to the left and that's tied to the enable of the motor and with that with the switch off the whole circuit is disabled because that's the enable switch so that has to be enabled in order for the motor attached to the IDC to work and for all operation so right now that's on and then there's two push buttons as to the right that you can see here and those control the logic states to the IC and that controls the motor movement whether it moves spins in one direction or spins in the other direction and right now these two buttons are low both low they're normally low by uh, pull down resistors but if I press down on one they turn high and how uh, the L293 H ridge works is if one is high and the other is low the motor will spin in one direction and if you reverse the polarity of the switches so that the one that was low is now high and the one that's high is now low the motor will spin in the other direction so to demonstrate this I have my motor here and I put a I put a propeller on it so that it can help you see how the motor is spinning so once I press down on this button you can see the motor is spinning in the uh, counterclockwise direction let me make it a little slower and then this is if it's fast and then let me try to get this standing if I turn the other switch you can see how it's now spinning in the clockwise direction so this is counterclockwise once I press one button and then if I press the other it spins in the clockwise direction and then if I press both it won't spin because if both are high this makes the motor stop and if both are low the motor won't spin so it's only when one is high and the other is low will it spin so this is how uh, H bridge circuit works with uh, L293 and before I stop this video let me disable it and then now you see nothing can work because it's disabled so it always has to be enabled for it to work and then it will spin so thanks for watching